Hello, everybody. Happy Thursday. Happy August 3rd. Um, I'm coming back and redoing this video that I did yesterday about a man murdered and stabbed by a Muslim, teen, a Muslim, but the Muslim was a teenager. So that's why I'm coming back. So, man fatally stabbed in a competition as he danced at a gas station. His name was, uh, I think his, it says, I'm not going to say his name. But what I am going to say is that uh, NYC man murdered by a Muslim teenager for voguing with friends at a local gas station. I wanted to come back on here and I wanted to correct what... Uh, I had said because I didn't, I, I did, it, it wasn't a whole lot of, a whole lot of things for me to say. It did say, I, I can't hardly see it in fine print, but it did say they had just left, I think it said a Beyonce concert. I'm thinking that they say that they just left a Beyonce concert. I'm not sure. Um, because I said some things on there. It uh was um I watched on Claudia Claudia Jordan show instead of uh, instead of uh getting the whole interview and searching for the uh information that I needed I did I I, I went on on what Claudia Jordan Funky Diva and Al was saying so but what i am saying it said that we live in a world today where we just can't be ourselves that's what i am going to say but uh i do stand by what i do anything that i do record i do stand by but at the same token uh i wanted to come back and get the right information and the correct information that i was given because I feel like I wasn't really given the right and the uh, correct information. So uh, I gave this information to y'all. So, um, of course, I'm not going to, I'm not going to say the person name be only because I don't want to say the person name because that got murdered due to uh, family purposes. You know what I'm saying? You know, they might not want the person. Like, I, I, I'm not like, I'm not a reporter. I'm not a journalism. I'm not like everybody to react to a story. I'm not going to go out there and sit there and release somebody's name when the family might not even want their name to be released. You know, that's just like Claudia Jordan, they did that. They did that on their show. And Claudia Jordan really calls herself a uh, a journalism. And I be trying to figure out, girl, how can you call yourself a journalism? I don't even think you went to school for it. You just got this little show, really a little podcast. That's all you got, a real little show, a real little podcast, you know, where y'all talk about or y'all react to different celebrities. Uh, that's really it. You know what I'm saying? Journalism is like when you do a news or something like that. I think people get that messed up. I mean, and then you, if you were such, such a journalism, why was you on a reality show? You know what I'm saying? And I, I don't like it when, you know, I'm not saying that when she gave the report that she was wrong. I'm not saying that. I'm saying it was good that she gave it. But it's funny how now you're giving a report about somebody being murdered by a Muslim teenager or voting with friends at a local gas station um, that allegedly might be gay when you were just the other day talking about trans women. And how y'all support y'all supposed to support us or let uh, or let them do this or let them do that. I, I'm not understanding. I mean, you know, some of the stuff that goes on in this world and some of the stuff that 
you know, she say on her show, I kind of just be like looking back, thinking to myself. Because I, uh, my mama said something to me yesterday. She said, you and your older sister is a type of uh, a type of person that will just sit back and observe. Yeah, I sit back and observe a lot. Because I'm going to sit there and tell you if I feel like that you... You saying the right thing. You know, this person got murdered by a Muslim team for bogging with friends at a local gas station. Whew. I just don't know, y'all. I just don't know. I just don't know. I'm sitting here looking at the video right now. Actually, not the video. I'm, I, I'm, well, yeah, the video. I'm sitting there looking at the video in the post. Now, I'm going to tell y'all what y'all can do if y'all want to see this. Go on YouTube to Nico's Anecdotes um, videos, and you will see what I'm talking about. Um... Because he posted it. I don't know what he said because I really don't want to listen to it, y'all. I I just, you know, I heard something about it. And I just thought, I, the fine print, I'm I'm reading. I'm going to put that down. And I'm, I, I had to come back and redo it because what I said yesterday when I recorded this video, I, I had um, gave the wrong information. I didn't quite give the, the information that was given to me. Uh, because I, from what I thought, that Clyde Nell was saying that he was murdered in his neighborhood because they were saying that a neighbor told him that watch who you hang around with because some of the people in this neighborhood is homophobic. So that's what I was given. So I didn't know that uh, this person. And I also want to say sorry to the parents for calling out his name because that's not usually what I do. You know, I don't usually call out people's names. Yeah. I mean, his name is on here. Well, I don't like to say people's name and I don't like to say people's uh, age. Because it got it on here. It says that Blah, 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 was bogging when men attacked him with gay slurs and told him to stop <coughs> a hate crimes test force is investigated. I got some good eyes for me to be written, nigga, and this so little. And at the bottom, it said, uh, I'm going to see if I can read it. Uh, it said, at the gas station, and the, I can't look at it because it, it's in, it's like in small fine print. You got to be up close for that part. So, um, yeah, it said, uh, I'm looking at the dude. And the dude was actually stabbed. Huh. Also, I'ma say this. Gay gay slurs was said. And the boy that got stabbed was taken up for his friends. But you know, I what I do know is this this uh was is about a I'm I'm sorry y'all that I look like this. Um we take up five friends. We do. We'll be willing to go down and fight for our friends. We do not care. It's just sad, and it's sad to say. And 
God forgive me for saying this, but it's it's hate to say that this had to go down like this. All because you don't like who I am or you don't like my sexuality. And I'm going to leave it there.